<clears throat> oh, fun with optics. Welcome back. Um, it's been a long time since I've wired um, guitars and stuff. So, in order to help my poor little brain, I've made this. Um, it's kind of like a, a little breadboard or a little mock-up. I've got my pickups in the position that they're going to be in in the guitar. And then I have the components as they will be on the guitar. The guitar will be like this. Jack, this is my tone with my coil tap. I believe it's going to be a coil tap. We'll see. Um, it's hard to find literature on this guitar to find out precisely what that is, but since it's got one humbucker, it's probably going to be a, it's going to tap one of those. And then the position switch. So, before I get it all in the guitar, um, I'm trying to figure out where everything goes, um, which is why you see all the stuff out here. Um, I do have to make a couple of, um, I have to do a couple of things. Number one, I have got a, a bridge that basically goes from the pot and then the two middle lugs on the coil tap part um, that I have to I have to connect those three points and then I have this little tiny looks like a 23k um, resistor um, and then uh, and I've got to get that again between the casing and this far left lug. Um, so I'm going to move those uh, over to there um, and then we'll start um, uh, getting some wires provisionally um, attached and set up uh, keeping in mind the distances that I have to go when it gets over onto that. Um, and then we'll be then we can set that off to the side and then um, start um, <laughs> Uh, wet sanding again. Man, it just never ends, does it? All right, we're gonna, you know, let's do this. There we go. All right, um, the sun is hitting me right in the face. So I'm just going to show you what we did here. Reconnected up the output jack using the old wiring. I'm trying to stay true to the old wiring as much as I can. Here is the uh, capacitor, not capacitor, the resistor. Here is the um, the bridge. This connects the case of the pot and these two middle lugs. And then I have this wire, which is going to go to ground and connects this with this. And so um, that's where we're at today. Um, and my brain hurts. Um, and I think tomorrow we're building a go board. So, all right, we'll uh, we'll continue on. All right. Okie doke. You knew it couldn't last long. Sanding. So here we are. The cured Area Pro Two. I guess I could take that rounding wire out of there. Um, there has been some spraying done on the back, so I'm going to go ahead and do the back first. And then the part that makes me really nervous is this part. Um, 
Good thing is, I don't have any, um, I can't really feel There's a little bit right there. But yeah, there's not a lot of texture. It's not like it's not like the Digicam guitar where you could just feel texture all over the place. Um, so I should probably get the right pad on here, shouldn't I? correct pad um, because it says right there wet sanding only um, 800, 1000, 1500, 2000 polishing compound wax assembly getting close um, so all right here we go. I love sanding. I really do. <clears throat> Alright, here we go. See how shiny and pebbly that is. Now you can see here areas that have not been sanded and won't be sanded. And all this is just flat, 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 flat. All gone this way. Flip it over and do this side with the neighborhood kids.